Hi, I'm DJ, aka Gemini Horror, and today we're going to be talking about Euclidean rhythms with the Square Pyramid. Now, this video is assuming that you already know what Euclidean rhythms are, but if you don't, I would suggest checking out the White Noises video on Euclidean rhythms. And there's also the Cabinet of Curiosity videos on Euclidean rhythms, and he actually uses the uh, Square Pyramid too, so that's really great. So in this example, I'm going to be using the Volca Keys as my bass. I'm going to be using the Volca FM as my melody and the Mutable Instruments braids with the kick waveform. What's interesting about the pyramid is that we can still apply MIDI effects while we're in Euclidean mode. So in this example, the uh, Volca FM will be putting a uh, chance on it. So only, uh, I think I'm going to be doing 90% of the notes. Only 90% of the notes will be played. I'll also be using a random effect in combination with a scale effect. And then with the Volca keys, I'll have a MIDI scale effect and I'll actually be changing it by hand. So it almost turns the pyramid into an instrument because I'm playing live. Obviously, it's not very precise, but it is pretty interesting. And the kick will just be a regular kick. I might change it up a little bit here and there, but it, it'll pretty much be doing the same kind of thing. What I also think is really interesting about the pyramid is that you see the notes over the sequence and you can add more notes or take notes out, uh, which is really cool. So let's check it out. Okay, so again, I got the Volca keys doing a bass, Volca FM doing a melody, and then I got the braids doing a kick. All right, so first I'm gonna play the uh, Volca FM by itself. Pretty simple. Then here is the keys. And then the kick. Now I'm gonna play them all together and I'm gonna start adding effects to the Volca FM. All right, so check it out. So first I'm gonna put a random on it. Change it to pitch. Go back to effects, so I'm gonna add a chance. Make it even more interesting. Maybe even a little less. And then on my Volca keys, I have a scale just to keep it everything in C major. So when I go to my step mode, I can change the notes and it'll stay in key. So we got a good little thing going. And what's really cool is something like the keys that has a delay built into it. I can add like another layer of craziness. Now I'm on the kick. And like I said, I can add or take away steps. You can see it change up here too. It's just so cool. And if you have any questions, leave them in the comments below. Thank you for watching.